So, uh, Professor Liu will ask you to do number three. So, number three, you draw a shooting target. A shooting target is a set of concentric rings in a、uh, alternative black and white color. So we're going to put a big circle, another smaller, another smaller, and your program should compose of you should have a class target, you have a target component, and you have target viewer. All right, you have target viewer. So this one is much more complicated. So I will ask you to click on next. <clears throat> so your video one is done, video two is done. I want you to see the three is helping information. So this is very important right now. I give you the file, but by this way. So we are going to draw a shooting、uh, target. So this class is ruled by teacher. So、uh, I want you to see how do you how do you create a program.、Uh, follow the all the way. Uh, a programmer need it. Now,、uh, uh, other program can use it. So this is a shooting target. All right. So, uh, we are going to see this. When I draw the shooting target here, I need radius. I need the radius. This is radius. I need radius. I need the x center. I need y center. Okay. So, I want you to take look. We're going to just draw one. We use use canvas. This is our canvas. From here to here is our canvas. Our canvas is our target component. So let's go to my target component right now. So this target class, and let's go to target component. Add a target component here. I defined it. I defined it. Okay. I define target. All right. Target. All right. So new target. This is very complicated here. I want you to let you see. Get width, right? So get width. What's the width right now? Eight hundred. Is that right? Get width is eight hundred. My friend is eight hundred. Get height. That's also eight hundred. So either one of them minimum. So if I have eight hundred, nine hundred, I need pick out eight hundred and divide by two. That's my radius. All right. So let's take a look here one more time. Take a look here. All right. So I I am going to see here right now. Let me have this right now. So make sure you understand this. Okay. Make sure you understand here. All right. So uh, suppose here. Oh, let me see here. Suppose here I have a a two hundred. Suppose two hundred here, width, all right, and suppose、uh, high also two hundred. Suppose like that, so two hundred, two hundred, all right, two hundred, two hundred. So based on all right, remember your target, all right. So, uh, hold on, let me close this, all right. So your target here. Your target here. Take first one is radius and x center, y center. Okay, so that's coming back right here, right now. So my canvas, my canvas. Already tell you that. All right. So my radius. I'm going to do this. If this is two hundred and this is, let me make this is three hundred. Okay, sorry. Let me just do this one, okay? And this is on your exam, okay? So make sure you understand this, okay? All right. So let me check it one more time right now. So now, if I have two hundred here, all right, and I have three hundred here, okay? Three hundred here. All right. So based on this right now. All right, get width is two hundred. Get height is three hundred. Minimum means smaller. What is between two hundred and three hundred? Which one is smaller? Anybody? 
anybody and can tell me let me have my chat right now anybody can tell me 200 is that that's very good so I got 200 300 here I need 200 what's 200 divided by 2 can you lengthen what's 200 divided by remember I have divided by 2 here so what's 200 divided by 2 100 100 so can you tell me my what's my radius right now can anyone tell me what's my radius right now 100 yes we have 100 so if I know my radius 100 right now my radius 100 right now the top left corner here is left and top is a left and top assuming this is zero zero right now zero zero and here okay one more time let's double check you know the number okay let me double check you know the number okay so 200 here is that right and uh 300 here all right so here this is zero zero is that right this is zero here okay so this zero zero okay now and this corner this corner here is 200 300 it's okay this corner is 200 300 got it so what's this what's this what's x center and y center can you tell me can you calculate and tell me what's x center and y center half of x is x wow very good i think we hung is 100 150 Is that right? Yeah. Correct? All right. So, I am uh, I am going to coming back here right now. Okay. Uh, so, first, I am going to have uh, what we're going to do is we're going to first draw a uh, first black circle black circle when we draw it we're going to use the uh and we don't have left right now so your left is your center minus radius is that right center minus radius remember center is 100 and if minus radius that's the la left and top so then you draw the circle you draw the circle with ellipse 2D with the top because when you do ellipse 2D dot double, you need the left, top, and width. But your width, remember, center is radius is 100. If my radius is 100, what's my width? 200. So 2 times radius. If my height here is 150, Sorry, we have to use 100, 100. Sorry, Big, my fault. Because we need to be a exactly the same. We draw a circle, we don't draw elapsed. My fault, Wei Han, you are right. 100, 100. All right, so we got this right now. Then, we'll, so we draw the first circle here. We're going to draw the second circle, white circle. Is the second circle smaller? Yes or no? Take a look. We don't want to do uh, complicate programming. We just do common sense. Does the second uh, white circle is smaller than the first black circle? Yes or no? Anybody? Yes. So 
When the second circle is smaller, the radius is smaller. How many is smaller? 20. So if the x radius x uh, if the radius is smaller, the then the left and because I have to do what? Left and top is one. X center minus radius. So radius is smaller right now. So left the left and top is different number now. Alright? Is shrinking to here. And then uh, now I have another black. That's smaller than the white. That's smaller. Alright, so this is a pattern right here. This is a pattern. Target, Java. I have three variables. Radius, X center, Y center. These will be default constructor. Take from user, radius. And we draw. When we draw the first one is black color. Once you finish the radius minus 20, you need to move to the new left position, new top position, draw it. This time is white color. Minus 20 again. And this is uh, move the new left, new top. Okay, we finish. Add your target component here. Add target component here. You extend J component. And here, we only draw one and the paint component here. We just draw one target, one target in this. But we make sure we give the right dimension. All right. So I give you the width and height divide by two. Then the width divide by two and height divide by two. All right. So now we are going to draw it. All the components are the same. We have 800, 800. Uh, U square is better. Yeah. <laughs> Or 600, 600. These are the code already. These are the code already. All right. So I I will let you complete. Let's see number four. Number four is Olympic ring. Okay. So let's go back right here. Just a minute. So number three is the target. Number four, you're going to write a program uh, display. So long.